Please be standing here. The whole video is a 10 minute video of me just like this. Yeah, this is not age my face at all. This mask is too small. Wear it like this. Gosh. Oh my goodness, this is so tough. Alright, we'll wear it like this. Doesn't, what's it called, dude, in the movie like this? Chadwick. Or if you follow me on Instagram, you know that I posted a video of me like dressed as Spider-Man. Or I was on live dressed as Spider-Man. And now I'm Black Panther. So today what we're going to be doing is we're going to go fish. We're going to make the most of having this costume. We're going to go fish in it. But we're going to start off with our lovely lure. And we're going to pick some lures off of it. Because, you know, that's kind of all we have here. Whenever we go fish, we can just select whatever we want. So first thing we're going to get is this little war pig right here. And we're going to get one of these color war pigs. Because this is like a kind of bluegill color. And then also we're going to use the skinny cutter. And now we are gonna be on the way to Walmart at Black Panther. Post every day, this is what it comes to. Like this is what day 16, 17 of uploading and now I'm in a Black Panther onesie with these gloves on. In a mask that doesn't fit my head. I can't, can you hear me? No. <laughs> Dude, you sound like Batman. I'm not gonna be able to wear my mask in the video at all because you're not gonna be able to hear it. So we're just gonna, we're gonna work like this and hopefully people come up and go, oh my gosh, this is Black Panther. Oh my God, it's Black Panther. All right, so to Walmart, we got. Even stores as Black Panther is gonna be the like whole thing of this video. Guys, if you clicked on this video, you thought I was gonna go to Walmart as Black Panther. I'm actually robbing every store in America as Black Panther. You think I can like go dance with the Salvation Army lady? Yes, sir. Can I can I get some? Can I shake it too? Thank you. <laughs> yes, sir. This is about to be so weird. Straight to the fishing stuff we go. They have a fishing rod right there. Dude, this is so weird. Like I've never felt like more judged in my life. Just watch, just watch how weird this is about to be. Nice. Right, good. How are you? <laughs> it's um, it's for a school project. We have everything we need. We don't need anything from Walmart. He just rattled me. Oh, we can't even leave right here. Look at that. <laughs> Everybody and their mom is at Burger King. Oh, gosh, that voice crack. Everybody and their mom is at Burger King. Well, not Burger King, but we're on the way to Burger King because I'm not trying to wait in this fat line. Black Panther shouldn't have to wait in lines anyway. You know, you know what I should have got out of there? A fishing rod in real life. I bet they have a Black Panther fishing rod. Can I take order, please? Uh, yes. Can I have a number eight and also eight of the jalapeno cheddar bites and a frozen Coke? I need my mask. Oh, here it is, here it is, here it is. Here it is, here it is. Yeah, I can. Okay, so guys, I can't like breathe or talk out of this mask. I probably should get my money out first. How about, you know how funny it would be if like I just stand and like sit still and you pay, you know? Hold on, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm really like hit something in this. I promise you guys, I did not mean to do that. Like that was not a pers purposeful act at all. Now to go fish. I have no clue where we're gonna go to fish at because literally every pond within 30 minutes of here sucks. So we might have to drive down to Florida. Like an eight hour road trip in Florida. One, two, three, like seven, eight ponds in this neighborhood. So we're gonna, we're gonna try to catch a fish. Honestly, I have zero faith in this. Not gonna lie to y'all, but I think we can make it happen at the same time for because you know, daily uploads. I'm in a Black Panther outfit. It's getting to me. All right, guys, it's currently like 30 something degrees out here, which is really cold for Alabama. But we're not gonna give up. We're gonna we're gonna catch a big mouth bass in our Black Panther costume. <laughs> be able to reel with these gloves on. I feel like that's gonna be the real challenge. Is like casting and reeling with these gloves on, but we're gonna figure it out. Honestly. I wouldn't say that. Oh, this is like dragging the mud. That's why it looks like that. Just walk on around here, just because it'll probably be like, we'll have a higher percentage chance. I'm not sure how deep this stuff is. I've never actually caught a fish out of it. So. Dude, this thing is so hard to reel. I literally see fish. 
Oh, it's following it. You see him? Yeah. They're following it. Oh my goodness. What if we catch one? Dude, if we catch one dressed up as Black Panther, I'm going to lose my mind. Oh my goodness. This is so, it's so hard to reel. I got a stick. We're going to give it like 30 minutes here, and if not, dude, I'm going to just have to go back, and we'll figure something else out for the video. Because... I mean, it could happen, but like at the same time, our fishing is really bad here now. Got some fish pond number one over there for about 15 minutes. Now we're at pond number two, it's just right across the way. We've been over here for about 10 minutes. Haven't caught anything yet. So we're gonna stop on this corner and then we're gonna go to this pond over here. And if we don't, if we can't catch anything, it is winter time in Alabama. I have another video for tomorrow that I really wanna do tonight. So. If we can't get on a big mouth bass, we're gonna go home and probably make some like Black Panther looking lures or something like that. So, make sure that you stay tuned for that. And it is really cold and we're just gonna go ahead and hit these spots and if we don't catch anything, you know what happens. So, stay tuned. Yo, what's up guys, welcome back home. That was a little bit of fun, uh, just wearing that Black Panther costume, trying to catch a fish and it did not work at all. Our plastic's ready. But what we're gonna do now is, I'm not gonna spend too much time making these lures. Well, I'm gonna spend a lot of time, but I'm not gonna like kind of do the typical lure making video where I show y'all all my steps. Um, normally I do that just because I'm never sure if it's somebody's first time watching my video and I want them. If you're trying to learn from me, I want you to be able to see the whole process. So we got our plastic in the microwave. Today we're gonna be doing these little swim bait molds. I'm not even sure if I've ever used these on the channel before, but the molds are cold now. So we're not gonna put them on the hot plate because we want that first layer of plastic to be nice and hot. And we're gonna do some like little black and purple style swim bait so hopefully they turn out pretty cool i've never done this before i know chris kind of exposed me to it when i went to tallahassee and filmed with him over the summer but hopefully we can get these swim baits looking nice and black panther-ish black panther-y that was um in the video i'm not sure if you can see it or not but i was walking through walmart i come out one of the aisles and a lady looks me up and down like this and she's like what are you doing and i'm 99.9 percent .9 sure she probably thinks I'm on crack, but hey, I mean, it's for the content. And vlogmas, you know, uploading every day is starting to get to me, I guess. Got on a, I wore a Black Panther costume today, so we're going to make ourselves some Black Panther lures. Here we go. Stay tuned. We're going to have a little bit different camera angle. I was watching some of my old videos when I was doing my recap video, and I kind of like how I used to sit the camera over here, and you can, like, just see, like, me and what I'm doing. All right, guys, so the plan for this is we're going to just use our thermometer and try to see if we can't just drizzle the plastic in the mold like that. Um... Cause I know if we pour it, it's definitely probably gonna, we're gonna get a little bit wider of a pour than we want. So we're gonna go ahead and take our plastic out. We need our stirring utensil. Make sure our plastic is nice and toasty. We go ahead and add our color to it. We're gonna, we're not gonna do a lot of purple. We're just gonna do a couple drops. One, two, three. And then we're gonna add some purple flake to it to give it a little bit of pizzazz. This is like some small little purple flake. But that's going to be the plan. You see how it kind of drizzles like that? We're going to try to get that same drizzle effect with our thermometer. Since it's a smaller point, I feel like we could get a finer line. Okay, I think our knife is going to be a better option than the thermometer. Okay, that should look pretty good. Gotta live with it. Got my money working, you know what I did with it. Take it to the field, treat it like a coin toss. Girl, I got it covered. I'm a Louis Loin cuff. We're gonna add our color to it. Should be good. We probably didn't even need that much. As long as that, I'm kind of scared for this purple plastic that it's just kind of gonna remelt, but. If it doesn't do that, we should have some pretty cool looking swim baits. All right, guys, I kind of got impatient and I want to go ahead and open up the molds because, I mean, it's only been like two or three minutes. I think they might need a little bit longer, but honestly, we might be good. So since we're not going to go fish with these today, let's see what we got. Okay. So, some constructive criticism. We're gonna do this again. We need to add some black to our purple because the all you can see is the purple flake and we probably need a little bit. We're gonna add some more purple and we'll add a little bit more black. But I mean, that's a start though, you see? That's a, 
That's an okay start. For our first time, we haven't done too much of this type of stuff, so we're not gonna be too hard on ourselves on these. These honestly don't look bad, like they're still fishable. I add some more black so we can get a darker black, and then we're also gonna add a little bit more purple to our mix. Trying to make some Black Panther themed fishing lures. All right, guys, so we got our swim baits poured. Got a little fast, fast motion for you. I'm thinking that this probably, I kind of did something that uh, Chris taught me in Tallahassee where you kind of like mix your colors together on the table and see how they combine. And I think the black probably is gonna overtake this purple. You can see it in there a little bit. It doesn't look, it's not the cleanest look, but I feel like we could fix it somehow and make it look better. I'm not really quite sure what that step would be to like make it look better, but I think we can definitely figure it out somehow. It would look a lot better though, like check that out. It does not look bad at all. And maybe, I'm thinking like maybe like a few drops of silver. We're gonna add some more purple. I want it to be like really, I want that purple to really be able to show, you know. All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and open up the mold one last time. Hopefully it looks, uh -oh, hopefully it looks good this time. I think that these should be pretty legit because we didn't really do any mixing of the colors. Oh yeah, look at that, that black and purple. I like the way that looks, that came out quite nice if I did say so myself. It would probably help if I showed it to the camera. Instead, I'm not sure if y'all can see that or not, that nice black and purple vibe. See like the, like the little pearlescent color that we put in the first time, you can definitely see it in this one. I know every time I try to turn my flashlight to show off lures, it kind of overdoes it, but hopefully you can see it in this one. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I'm gonna give you a little close-up of all today's lures, but we had a good time today. It was something a little bit different. It's kind of weird. I don't know if I'll be doing that one again, unless y'all want to see me dress up as Frozone, because that's what I really want to do. I really want to get a Frozone costume and be like, where's my super suit? Go to Bass Pro or something like that on top of the on top of the roof at Bass Pro and ask for my super suit. Thank you all for coming and hanging out with me today. It's a little bit different style of upload, but anyway, fish them hard and have a good day. Let me know what you want to see next on the channel. I'm kind of, I'm slowly starting to run out of ideas for vlogmas. I have enough ideas to last me until the 29th, so I need two more video ideas to let, or to get me through the 29th and the 30th and the 31st. Yeah, and January 1st, because we had to start the year off on a good foot. We had to upload on January 1st. Anyway guys, fish them hard and have a good day.